I'm Miguel Latronica, inventor of the Mighty Body Band, and I just want to take the time to show you about how the unit can easily be used from an Iyengar wall, it can be used from a wall at a home, it can be used on a door, tree, or any stationary object capable of holding weight. In the Mighty Body Band, uh, there are three different versions. This particular version I'm showing you now is the professional version we're from. So, You'll see uh, in our studio here at Yoga Bed, we have a strip of wood and we have um, these eye hooks. The eye hooks are set 82 inches from the floor, right? And there's a carabiner here in place. I don't know if Susie can view in and show you the carabiner. This carabiner is a spring loaded uh, piece of hardware, right? And from here, we can take the professional version and we can pull it off. Do that. So in a little while, I'm going to show you how this Mighty Body Band professional version can be hooked up to a door as well in your home, your office, or any yoga studio, right? So again, I've got it. I'm going to hook it back up to my carabiner, and it's into place. And then now Susie will view in here. This is a, a quick release tab right here. You put your thumb on it, you hold it up so you can see right now it's actually parallel to the floor. When you hold it up, you'll see I can just very easily pull it and it lengthens. It lengthens four to five feet, five feet long. Okay? And then to shorten it, I just simply grab both ends and I pull and I lift and then I shorten it up all the way. Alright? You'll notice here that I can disconnect this uh, piece of webbing with the silver o-ring and there again is a silver swivel hook. So I put the o-ring on, I take it off. When the o-ring is on, you'll notice, Susie may be viewing in on me here, when I pull this, nothing really happens. It's a static band. And when I come and take that same silver o-ring and I disconnect it, you'll notice here where my hand is at, there's two um, knots with almost looks like two antennas. And then you can see that I have this bungee cord material. Now, when I lean back like this and I pull it, you can actually see from this point here to here, when I stretch it, it's got a lot of dynamic um, pull to it. So we hook it up statically, dynamically, and that's it. You'll notice there's a yellow triangle that's sewn into this blue webbing. Everything in the unit is color-coded from the top to the bottom. And so this blue webbing goes with this blue webbing of the handles. So here's one handle and here's two, one for each hand. You can also hook these around your legs and various other uh, limbs of the body. So I set it down and you'll notice here there's a black tab. If I lift this tab up with my thumb, you'll notice that this now lengthens. So it's an adjustable band, handles, that can be used for uh, many different purposes. So I'm going to tighten it up all the way. I want to show you something else, which is an upgradable um, item. It's what I call the PNF handles. So you'll notice it's very different. This has got, instead of the blue lines, actually maybe I'll hold them both up and I'll show you. So the blue ones here are what I just took off. And you'll notice there's two handles on there. Can you view in there, Susie? And then on here, my left hand here, you'll notice the two black um, bungee cord-like materials with the two handles. All right, so this is static and this is dynamic. You've seen the static. I'm going to set that down for now, take my dynamic handles, and hook it up to the black swivel hook right beneath the yellow triangle. And then maybe Susie can view in here, and you'll notice now this whole thing, it pulls. It pulls me up, it takes me down, right? So I can work very dynamically or statically into just a mode of different poses. And also you'll notice that these handles, they disconnect because there are other accessories and things that one may want to use. So I have that. I'm going to take this 
dynamic hand over, off, set it down, come back and grab my static handles and put them back up. All right? So working down further, you'll also notice that I have what we call here the hip extender. And there are many different um, things to do with the hip extender, but most of the time it just simply comes over your body. And of course, you'll notice all the other um, uses through photos and different um, video clips regarding the mighty body. Okay? So I'm going to take it off, take my body outside of it. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect this from the stationary unit of the wall, like that. And then Susie's going to take the camera with me, and just, you can pick the whole camera up if you want, Susie. And then we're going to walk in, look at two doors. So Susie, why don't you put the camera there? What? And then, so here I have the Mighty Body Band, the professional version right here ready to be cooked up through the door, to a door. So, first thing I want to do is I'm going to set my unit down and I'm just going to pull the door closed. Right? So, when I pull the door closed, you'll notice it's up against the door jamb. So again, I open it and I pull it closed. Whenever you're using the Mighty Body Band with a door, it is imperative you must unequivocally, no exceptions, you must use the outside of a door when you pull it closed, okay? Having said that, I'm going to open up the door, and then I'm going to have Susie, maybe you might have to move over a little bit, Susie, and Susie's going to show you the three different hinges. So you're probably moving over a little bit, and that's it. Good. And then maybe from here, you'll see, you zoom in on the first one, Susie? Mm -hmm. Most doors have three hinges, okay? Mm -hmm. So you're zoomed in, that's the first one, that's the top one. There's a second one right here, second hinge, and then there's a third one on the bottom. 90% of the time you'll either be using the professional version at a door from the upper to the middle, okay? Now, what I'm going to show you now is when you order from our website, what you get is you get the whole Mighty Body Band, whether it's the Lux, whether it's the um, Premier or the Professional. You get this lateral door strap. It's just a nice, strong strap, and it wraps around the door. So a minute ago, I just showed you the three different hinges. So what I want to do here is I want to take my female end, meaning there are no prongs, with the two D-rings, and I want to feed it through the slot of the door by the hinge. So Susie, mm -hmm. move you into this, mm -hmm. and you'll see how that comes in, and then I just slide it through, okay? So you can see how I'm feeding it through. Then, I'm going to come on the inside of the door, okay, you can see me okay, mm -hmm. Susie? And I'm going to grab the strap, and you'll see I can pull it up. Now, you can see how this would work here. You want to make sure there are absolutely no kinks and then or twists. And Susie, can you see this? So I take this, maybe I'll pull the door closed, right? And I snap them together like that. Huh? The thing is, you want this to be on the inside of the door. So I'm going to open up the door again. Now that you see how it works, I'm going to pull this all the way up and around. And then this is where you'd hook it up to. Now, one of the things that I want to show you that's really important, I'm going to just close the door for now, and I'm going to grab the Premier version. So this, a little while ago, I used it in the studio, and it was on an eye hook 82 inches above the floor. So because I'm using it at a door, so Susie, you really have to kind of view in on this one, I take, I shut the door, and I know my uh, female one is on the other side. That allows me to take this male end and feed it through the lateral door connector. Can you see that okay, mm -hmm. Susie? Mm -hmm. Feed it through, and it's like that. Then, I can hold it right here if I want, and it's in place. It slides across, 
Then what I do is I'm going to open up the door, okay, and I'm going to take both ends and pull it together. Now, Susie, could you come in here and then maybe you'll move in the back and I'm going to show how you would hook it up. So she's going to come in. I've got the Mighty Body Band Pro hooked up to the outside of the door. Yeah. Okay, so here you can see I take the male end here and the female end and I snap them in together. There are no twists or turns. Now, I don't know if you can get this, Susie, but it's really important. When you tighten this up, you want to make sure that your brown buckle is at least six inches away from the edge of the door. So that way, when you take the tail end of the lateral door strap to tighten it up, you'll hold with your left hand the two D-rings and you'll set your fingers at the edge of the door like this and then you'll tighten this up. You see how I pull that tight? Now, if I need to, I adjust it, and then, can you see this okay, Susie? Mm -hmm. I take my palm, put it at the edge of the door, I take my fingers, wrap it around, and then, do you see how I just tighten it up like this? It tightens up very nicely, and this here can hold a lot, so I can really pull this thing tight. As a matter of fact, you'll close the door, and on a new strap, she'll pull it a little bit just to take out all the, the slack, especially with the new band. And you'll notice it looks nice and tight, but I'll still be able to get a little bit more slack out. So if Susie views in on this, you'll see just a little bit more I get. And I use the pad of my palm up against the door to pull it tight. I close the door, I've got my two D-rings. And you see these okay, Susie? Mm -hmm. Alright, so I take my tail end around in through the two D-rings, you see, one, two, right, two D-rings, mm -hmm. just like that. Then through the two, I separate them and I come back through the center. When I come back through the center, then I pull it nice and tight. It's a safety measure that can hang down and then I'm all ready to start using the uh, Mighty Body Band. Um, product. No twists or turns. Very nice. It's out of the way of the, if you look here, it's right up out of the way. If I wanted, I could pull this up a little bit. It doesn't get caught up into the um, yeah. hardware there. And then I close the door. Again, I'm going to use this unit on the outside of the door. So now I know if I'm pulling firmly, there's no way that the door could fly open because the door is up against the door jam, okay? And in the same thing, just as in the studio, I can do all the same things. I can work statically like this. I can disconnect the swivel, the silver o-ring from the swivel hook. And then again, I've got this nice bouncing material, right? The bungee cord. I hook it back up. I leave it the way it is. Doesn't matter. So, statically. I can take it, I can take myself and take it up through the head, and then the same thing if I want to work on back bends, right? I can up against the door, I have a mat underneath me, and the same thing, I can work any way I want into these poses. If I want to use my handles, I would take myself, for example, into Virabhadrasana 1, and I could press my arms slightly into them, I can look up grab them further from behind so that I can work with the external rotators, right? And there's all kinds of things. So this is a tight office. You see this desk to the right of me, but either way, I mean, I just work into really nice. I can work into these nice um, Parshvatanasana poses, spinning the shoulder blades back, coming back up, breathing into it, right? I can work into my lateral bends with these handles, so when I work the base of my feet wide, I inhale, you see, and I pull, and it's almost like a flossing method, you see how my arm moves, and I work deep into these poses. For down dog, I can take my two handles, put them into the back of this loop, and the same thing, which is why you want a mat underneath, I'll probably cut this part out, but anyway, you come in and you can see. Working in, breathing deeply into the poses. Yeah? 
and this plus about 2,000 other poses is what you'll explore. So I hope that this video shows you how to hook up the Mighty Body Band to a door, how to hook it up into an Iyengar studio, and then it's just a lot of switch outs, a lot of fun. You can work from dynamic candles to static candles. You can disconnect and reconnect all these different accessories. So thank you, Miguel Electronica. Namaste.